looked at the marketplace and we realized that minivans are incredibly practical and they serve a great purpose. But you kind of sell your soul a little bit in order to get that practicality. An SUV or a crossover has all the character and style and panache that you want in a vehicle, but not necessarily that practical in its usability from a customer perspective. So our goal was to blend both practicality and a sexy vehicle into one. And that's where we ended up with Model X. But in the spirit of Tesla, we also wanted to make sure that we carry forward innovation beyond just the powertrain. So this vehicle is really a continuation of some of the innovation that you experience in the Model S. We brought forward the big 17-inch screen on the interior, which really revolutionizes the interior of automobiles. Suddenly, your car is now relevant over time. As the car grows and ages with you, it gets better and better. There's no other product or, or automobile in the marketplace that improves over time, and we can work with you as a customer to improve them. You can personalize your car. We push firmware updates that improve the drivability, the usability. There's apps that come with it. So the experience gets better as you live with the car. And it tailors and tunes towards you. We brought that forward into Model X. The other innovation, things like the retractable door handles. Model S is the most aerodynamic sedan in the marketplace right now. The CPU points too far. And we wanted to carry that same innovation into Model X. The character of the car with its low CD and really uh, efficient center line profile, flat floor on the bottom, again, it's going to provide an incredibly efficient car that translates back into range for the user. And then, of course, as many people have maybe have seen, the innovation doesn't stop there. We wanted to develop accessibility unparalleled in any other SUV. So we created the Falcon Wing Door, which creates an opening into the second and third row. This is a three-row vehicle, seven passengers. Yeah, we didn't want the design to be inhibited, uh, inhibit that actual practicality. So you see the muscular sinewy feel, the athletic poise of the car. That's our family character. You'll see that in every Tesla as we move forward. The athletic poise um, and character is an inherent quality of Tesla. And then we give you know, the surprise and delight element. And this car, just like Model S, has more interior volume than other cars in its, in its uh, category. And just like Model S, as a front. We also didn't stop there, even though we have all-wheel drive and a motor between the front wheels of this car, we still made sure that there's that there's room for the front. And as you can see, this front is about the same size as what's on Model S. So any space that we potentially lost with our aero efficiency fast back feeling we gain back into the front. And I challenge you afterwards to come up and, and check out the car because you'll see behind the third row is more volume and more space than in most third row SUVs that take up a bigger footprint than any other product. So again, we're looking at developing the family for Tesla. It started with Roadster, but the true Tesla spirit is really in Model S and its innovation and its uncompromised approach to the segment of vehicles. The next stop along the way is Model X. Innovation in Falcon and doors, storage, usability, uh, unparalleled performance, 0 to 60 in 5 seconds, all wheel drive for all different climates. Um, and then, you know what's coming? The next motor trend, car of the year, we hope is the Gen 3 vehicle. Um, and that is going to have the same family characteristics that I was just talking about. So, thank you very much. Thank you for recognizing Tesla as doing something different in the industry, moving the needle, getting people aware. And our main mission, our main goal is really to rid the world of its addiction to fossil fuel. We want to do it one car at a time, and, and it takes all of us to try to get there. So, thank you very much. 
you saw it first with the fast lane car.